Hi, hello, welcome to another video from AutopostingTools.com. Today I want to show you how you can use the CRM to manage all your clients or all the people that you contact uh, for your business. So in this case, we have this tool called AutopostingTools.com, which contains many different modules. Uh, you can find it on AutopostingTools.com. If you want to see what all the other modules are about just visit autopostingtools.com and then just scroll through the videos to see the other different modules today in a specific we're going to talk about the customer relationship management where you track all your clients and all your customers so let's just uh, go to open it in this uh, program that you get on autopostingtools.com you go here on mini tools and then you go to CRM custom relationship management and you open it as you can see here I have two tests basically here is going to be the people that I contact to make business with so in this case I have test one test two uh, basically the program is going to include here on this table all the different people that you want to work with basically the way you add a new client is that you put new client here then you just fill out the information. In this case, I'm going to do test four. You fill out all the information here, uh, the the proper way, and basically you put create new contact. Once you create a new contact, the new contact is going to show up on this table, and all the information from that table is going to show up on these fields. These fields basically contain the information from the table, and are uh, there so you could just select whatever information you need and copy it and paste it on whatever place you need to have it you could have the contact name the company name of the com uh, of the contact the depart department where he belongs to the email uh, if you put his, his if you put here his website and you click this button it's going to open up open up the website uh, you can also put the phone number, like different contact information that you could have, the billing address and the shipping address. This is important. So when you are going to be creating um, creating quotes, the billing information, this is where it's going to get it from. So you can also put notes about this client and you can put any other relevant information that you have. So now for this contact, basically you can add activities that you uh, use with uh, that you did with this client. For example, I can just go here on activities, and for the contact name or the client number test four, I can add a new activity, and I'm going to put uh, call the client, uh, and I just uh, type the activity that uh, I'm going to do there. I can change the status here. Uh, if it's something to do, if it's something that I already did, or if I cancel the activity. So call the client, the client about payment. And basically here you type the priority. If it's something that you really need to do now, you put urgent. If it's something that can wait, you put lowest priority. If it's something like it doesn't matter. You just put high priority so this is the more urgent one this is the lowest priority you select which one you want and basically you put uh, the when you are going to start and when this thing need to be done and basically but this is the day of today I could put it that I'm going to start the number 8 the 28 and I just save it so the new activity was created and it's here so as you can see, whenever I select a different uh, user, my activities change to that new user. So if I select test two, text four, it's going to show up here. Uh, I can select this activity. I can modify it, add more information, add notes, depending like whatever uh, resolution happened. The client sent payment. And then I can change the status here to complete it. And I just click modify activity so as you can see the activity was completed so I don't have to do that anymore you if you had more information here you could order it by uh, the different status by order of alphabetical order by priority so you do first the ones that has the highest priority and also you can order it by date 
uh, if you don't like this activity of it's something that you already did and you don't want to have many activities there you can also delete it it's going to show up this window and then you click delete activity so basically this is a powerful way to manage all your contacts you just add all your contacts here and whenever they are here whenever you are going to be using the quote system they will be showing up there and here we are going to have the invoices and the quotes that will be showing up later uh, whenever you make a quote it's going to show up here so the client you will see what uh, transactions have you done with your client what what you sold and what you what the client received and everything so this is the CRM system that is going to allow you to manage your clients, your contacts, and type all the information that is relevant for them so you could have all in one place. So thank you for watching. If you want to get this tool, it's part of the autopostingtools.com. As you can see, this is uh, the page. You can go through every single video here and whenever you click on the video it's going to show up and it's going to give you more information about it so here is also the crm that we're going to be uh, uploading the video for this so the next video is going to be the inventory and the point of sale system so keep watching thank you for uh, visiting my website and uh, just go to the autopostingtools.com and you can get this software here thank you very much bye bye